Hello YouTube, and this is our freshly purchased Remington A70 Tactical 12 gauge pump action home defense shotgun. She is very nice, very nice weapon. Very easy to use, very effective. We fired about 75 rounds yesterday, getting a nice feel for it. And as you can see, there's nothing really special about it other than the pistol grip and the stock uh, there will be modifications and changes made to it uh, including a rail system for holographic sight as well as a tack light and a saddle mount for uh, reserve ammunition uh, I think it's very uh, very low recoil for a 12 gauge shotgun um, very short barrel uh, Smooth barrel can fire either shot or slug. Um, my personal preference is slug, of course, but uh, shot is pretty pretty useful for up close and uh, you know as well as sport shooting, which we done quite a bit of sport shooting yesterday. Um, <clears throat> it is quite it's easy to handle, but it is uh, it is slightly a little on the heavy side for such a small compact shotgun um is very you can handle it one-handed but it is very uh it is very uh pretty heavy especially uh to the receiver in the barrel end uh, which you know is kind of expected considering what it is uh, i found operating and loading the weapon very very easy very simple um in fact, I dare say it's actually easier to operate than a AK platform, which, you know, as everyone knows, is a very simple weapon, very effective, but also very ugly. At least, uh, at least our beautiful little 70 here is a lot, lot nicer to look at. Um, as I said, we're going to do a few uh, modifications to it. Uh, none today, of course. They'll be uh, as we as we progress with uh, tactical training as well as. Uh, safety training with the weapon. Um, I've, of course, grew up around guns a lot as a kid, so I know how to how to fire and operate it, and you know, know the basics of keeping uh, you know keeping it safe. Um, a lot of interesting ammunition could be used for this gun. Uh, anything from, as I mentioned earlier, slug, shot, even uh, flashbang rounds, incendiary dragon's breath rounds, flechette rounds. Uh, all kinds of all kinds of rounds can be used for this gun. Um, of course, I can't really think of a practical purpose to have incendiary rounds or um, anything like that. Um, but you know, it would make the Fourth of July a little more interesting, I believe. Um, the gun is, of course, unsafe and is unloaded right now. Um, but that can also, you know, change rapidly. I keep it locked in a case so it's only safe and put away. Um, don't want the kids getting hold of it, of course, or anyone that shouldn't have hold of it, hold of it. Uh, so here's the case I acquired with it. It's a nice little standard case, and I put the, this is originally designed to go through the, uh, under here. And up through there. Um, however, you know I don't uh, don't need to do that. I'd rather the gun be ready. So what I do is when I put the cover back together in the case, see this hole here and here. I put the lock through that. So that way, there's no way anyone's even getting to the weapon. Uh, I figured that was a little a little more effective of a safety. This is the beginning of our bug out bag if anything was to happen we got several medical supplies as well as 25 rounds of ammunition there is a knife in there there is as i said various medical supplies there will be a tack light as well as batteries other provisions uh filters even a gas mask in time um so this is the beginning of our you know prepared for any scenario situation 
hopefully nothing happens. And as, you know, if you've watched any of my previous videos, you know I don't believe in that FEMA camp bullshit. Or the government uh, taking down its cash cow, which is, of course, the working civilian citizen. And, of course, uh, the cat wants to photobomb the video. But whatever will make him famous, huh? Yeah, don't let his cute looks fool you. He's actually a very terrible, terrible, evil cat with evil intentions toward mankind. He's a terrible, terrible cat. He will not let people sleep. And if you're in the shower, God help you because he will attack you. But uh, <clears throat> enough about me, enough about the cat, and enough about my 12 gauge, which he seems to be taking a liking to. Get off my gun there, cat. Um, without further ado, thank you everyone for watching my video. And please comment, subscribe, like or dislike, negative or positive comment. I respond to them all, so you keep watching them, I'll keep making them. Stay safe, everyone. Remember, safety first. Never uh, use a firearm for anything silly or stupid. It's strictly for sport, hunting, or self-defense. Never should be used for assaulting people or taking people down for any such purpose. Be a man, use your fists, not bullets. Peace and love. God bless.